Okay, just for fun, this is way outside most people's comfort zone. But if you have a cool £100,000 to spend on a motorhome, you can get a Contiki 650 Lowline with four berths and four seat belts. That's a lot of money to spend on a motorhome. It's a nice size garage though. What you got at the back? Oh, they've got one of those sky window things. I like them. I do like them. Let's go and have a look inside. The Contiki is the Swiss top of the range range. And um, yeah, they are lovely. They're really nicely put together. But, sorry, I went to see how long it is. Oh my goodness, it's nine meters. Five tons, nine meters. That's crazy. So, lovely dinette area. Look at the space and the headroom. All right. Hold on. I'm six foot near enough, like 5'11. Jeepers, that's eight foot, maybe seven and a half, eight foot. That's crackers. It's huge. It's lovely upholstery. So we've only got, you've got four seat belts. I mean, it's enormous. What the heck? What? What? Okay, we're exploring. <gasps> It's got zip pockets on the cupboards. Why? I can't unzip it. And I can't zip it anymore. Yeah, let's, let's, let's try this side. <laughs> there we go. That was better. It's just a normal cupboard. Why does it have a zip pocket? I've never seen that before. Ooh, this is brand new. It feels really stiff and, oh wow, look at the dashboard or whatever you're gonna call that. Look how funky it is. I like that. That's really cool. Okay, so back here you've got decent storage. Perfect for shoes. Really good for shoes. That would be where you put your TV if you have one. Quite a nice place. Massive kitchen. I mean, you could easily live in this. Easily. I do like all the funkiness they've got going. They've got a separate oven and grill. And they've got a four hob, not a three hob. Loads of storage. Oh, look at that. Oh, I wonder if we could get one of those in ours. Oh, that's an excellent idea. That's really clever. I wonder if we could fit one of those in our cupboards, even if it was just one of them. And then round here, well, oh, that's neat. Oh, I like that. That's really pretty. Loads of storage up here as well. Loads of storage. And then round here, we've got a separate fridge and freezer, which is a nice microwave. Oh God, that's really stiff. Random cupboard that not many people who aren't my height would be able to reach. And then, oh my goodness me, magic. Now, am I the only person in the world who hates carpet in a bathroom? Is it just like a pet hate thing? So you'd shut that door and then you've obviously got, oh, you've got slidey doors. Yeah, okay, they've locked them. I'm not going to do that. You shut that door and you shut that door. You've got a huge shower. Come on, it would be rude not to grin. Yeah. It doesn't feel as spacious as the other one, but I guess because so, we've got an extra thing on there, but you've got a fairly decent amount of room. And if you look from out here, I don't like the carpet on the shower. I'm sorry, I just don't. What's... Oh, a bit of confetti. I'll pick it up for them. Um, it's nice. So I like the little heater thing you've got going on. That's nice too. Although there isn't a whole lot of wardrobe space. You've got a little wardrobe there with a rail. So you've got his and hers wardrobes, which would be really good because I'm constantly being told that I have too much space in the wardrobe. And honestly, it's not me. It's really not me. Um, I love that window. I've always loved that window. I just think that's stunning. Decent sized bed. I mean, you've got a huge amount of space. Of course you have, it's nine meters long and it's a hundred thousand pounds. It's lovely. I wouldn't have it. I certainly wouldn't spend a hundred grand on it, but it's lovely. All right, gang. In my whole, let's find the most expensive motorhome we possibly can. This is a platin, platin, platin? Mercedes Frankia. A 
157k is the standard price. It's nine or eight and a half meters long, five and a half tons. You can have two, four, five. But look at all the, the range that they've got. So this is this one up here, it's an A-class. And this is the bit that we're not allowed to show my husband. Because you can get a pretty big, I'm trying to see how big that bike is. It's definitely a 125, might even be a 250, you know. Somebody who'll be able to look at the front of that and tell me exactly what it is, but I am not that clever. But just how? It's got a, oh, it's got a ramp. That bit on the back, I think, folds down. I think that goes down. No, it doesn't. It goes up. Oh, okay. So how do you get the bike in? I'm going to see if I can find there's a, there was a man in here. Excuse me. Do you mind if I film you and ask you a question? You can ask me a question. How do you get the bike in the garage? Is there a ramp? There's a ramp, yeah. Okay, so is it, what, is it the one at the back that folds down? It's, um, no, it's... Sideways one. It's actually um, in a hold all. Okay. On the inside of the motorbike. Oh, clever. So basically it hooks Sorry. onto... Oh, brilliant. Thank you. It hooks onto here. Yeah. Okay. And you just and ride it up. You just ride it up or push it up. I don't show much. Is it a 250 that one? 125. That's fantastic. That's, I'm impressed with that. That's cool. Do you mind how film inside or? No, help yourself. Thank you. Um, we want you to film as many as you like. It's lovely. It's really lovely. So we're just going to make the television work. Go, make the television work. Oh, it's got an electric drop down bed on this one. And then let's sit in the front, it's an A class. You just feel like you're sort of on a spaceship on these ones. It's nice, look at the dash. Very smart. Very smart. I'll squish past you if you don't mind. Sorry, no, no, thank you, that's all right. Oh, I do like your spice rack. Huge headroom as well, it's lovely. Yeah. Really and smart. 390 mm double floor. Oh really? So it's so, good for winter and all sorts? Yeah, yeah. Perfect. Highest in the industry. Is it? As in, in insulation. Wow. Huge sink. Well that's neat, I like that. You've got so that feels in there, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that goes Back there. Up. Oh wow! I would never have figured that. It goes there. That's clever. And what does this one do? Well, that's the bin. Well, of course. Oh, you see, if only I had 150 grand to spend. Oh, no, perfect, that. That is lovely. And I cool do like, that. it's really nicely made. You can feel it. It's really, yeah, perfect. You've got a four burner hob on there. Oh, yeah, you do. Lovely. And you can on the definitely shower. do the funky chicken in that. Resin tray. And then a decent sized bedroom. And bathroom here. Yeah, I'll work my way around to that one. It's really smart, I like it a lot. It should be nice though. Yeah, but to be fair for that much money. But that'll shut like that, and then you've got a huge bathroom area. Let's do that one. Check. Yeah, that's really smart. Really nice. You haven't put any extra lights in either, have you? It's just the lighting that's in the van. It's totally standard, it's all dimmable. Yeah, really smart. Really, really smart. Thank you very much for your time. No problem. Yeah, nice range. I will get out of your hair. Sorry, thank you. Okay.